So guys, Android 4.3 isn't officially out for the Galaxy S3 yet. If you have a Galaxy S3 and you want to get the latest Android 4.3 on it, you need to go for a vanilla custom ROM. The best vanilla ROM out there is CyanogenMod 10.2. So once again guys, if you aren't clear about it, CyanogenMod is vanilla Android, which means your Samsung TouchWiz features like the multi-window and the smart stay options will not be available here. This is vanilla Android, kind of similar to the experience you get on Nexus devices. So if you want to get CyanogenMod 10.2 on your phone, here are the prerequisites. One, this works only with the international variant of the Galaxy S3, that is the i9-300. Two, your Galaxy S3 needs to be rooted and have a custom recovery like clockwork mod recovery installed. If you guys haven't done that already, you can follow my tutorial on how to get it done. I will leave a link to my tutorial on how to root the Galaxy S3 and get a custom recovery installed right below the like button in the description. So guys, the first thing you do is click one from the download section in the description. That will take you to this page. Over here, select the latest CyanogenMod 10.2, uh, the zip file, download it, then click on link to from the download section in the description. That will take you to this page. Over here, download the G apps for Android 4.3. Now once you've downloaded both zip files, transfer it to your internal or external memories on your Galaxy S3. Once you've done that, go ahead back up everything on your phone because we will be doing a factory wipe here. Once you've done that, go ahead turn your phone off. Now once the Galaxy S3 is off, go ahead hold up volume, power and home at the same time. Once you see Samsung Galaxy S3 displayed, you can let the keys go. This will take you to cl clockwork mod recovery. So over here, the first thing you do is go to backup and restore and select backup. So this is in case you guys need to come back to your current settings, your current ROM. Uh, this is the easiest way to come back. This is not mandatory, but it is highly uh, recommended. All right, so now if, uh, assuming that you've backed everything up and you've also done a backup from Clockwork Mod Recovery, let's go ahead, select install zip from SD card. So for those not familiar with Clockwork Mod Recovery, the volume buttons over here act as navigation keys and the power button doubles as uh, a selection key. So select install zip from SD card. So if you have the files on your internal SD, select choose zip from internal SD, else select choose zip from SD. So just navigate to wherever it is that you have the file. I've got it in CM 10.2. So guys over here first uh, uh, select the CM 10.2.zip, hit yes install. So this will take about a minute to finish, uh, just wait for it to complete. All right guys, it's done. So uh, once it's done, again, navigate to the same uh, folder and select the gapps file. Again, hit yes install. And this will take a few seconds, just wait for it to complete. And I've just select go back and now wipe data slash factory reset. Yes, delete all user data. Go down wipe cache partition. And now go into advanced and wipe down the cache. So now select, re uh, I mean go back and hit reboot system now. So your phone will now boot back up. Keep in mind the first boot of any ROM is a little longer than your regular boot time. So uh, if it takes a few minutes for your Galaxy S3 to boot up, do not be, I mean, do not panic. Your phone will boot up, just wait. All right, guys, we're up. Let me quickly run through setup. So there we go. Quickly going into settings. About phone. And there you see Cyanogen Mod, Android version uh, 4.3, Jelly Bean. So guys, that's pretty much it for the installation of Cyanogen Mod 10.2 onto your Galaxy S3 i9-300. If you guys run into any issues or if you have any queries, feel free to hit us up at cursedforever.com slash forums. And in the meantime, if you guys do have any video requests for me or if you just want to stay updated on my latest videos and updates, you can hit me up on Facebook, Twitter or Google+. The direct links to all my social networks can be found right below the like button. So I guess that's pretty much it for this video, guys. If you liked it, don't forget to give me a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button. And I'll see you guys soon with more videos. Till then, this is Ashio from CursedForever.com signing off. You guys have a great day. Bye-bye now.